During the time of Lord Buddha, there lived a dacoit named Angulimal in the kingdom of Kosala, who had killed hundreds of people. How many people had he killed? He used to cut off the fingers of all of them and wear them in his garland, hence his name was Angulimal. He was very cruel and cruel. People were afraid to even go to that side in the forest where his area was. The king sent his army several times to capture him, but all failed. Buna realized from his knowledge that somewhere in the mind of Angulimal there is a feeling of mercy and compassion. He just needs to be awakened. Thinking this, the Buddha went to that side, in the forest where Angulimal used to live. People forbade Buddha a lot from going that way, but he did not stop. Angulimal, seeing Buddha coming toward him, ran with his sword, but Buddha continued at his natural pace. He shouted loudly, stay down, the Buddha stopped. When Angulimal came to the Buddha, he said, I have stayed, but when will you stay? You also stopped from sinning. That's why I have come here that you too should follow the path of truth. Virtue has not died in you. If you give it a chance, your body will change. Lord Buddha told Angulimal that you should bring it by breaking the branch of the tree. Angulimal broke the branch of the tree and brought it to the Buddha. Buddha told him to add it now. Angulimal said, How is this possible? I can't do this, Buddha said to Angulimal, that when you cannot join something, it has no right to break you. Buddha was very quick in this point. On hearing this, Angulimal's hair stood up. Buddha's words had a very good effect on him. He got cold. He fell at the feet of Lord Buddha and started pleading for forgiveness. It was the first time anyone had spoken to him with such love. Angulimal said, Forgive me and make me your follower. I am ready to accept this discipline. He threw off the garland of his fingers and fell at the feet of Buddha. He became a monk at the same time and after some time he also attained the rank of Arhat. He also followed the path of truth along with Buddha.